Hi guys, Blue Adventures. Right, hoping you can hear me because I've put the mic, as you can see, there. It's just that holding it all the time was just getting on my nerves. So I'm hoping this is gonna be clearer for you guys. Right, what are we doing here today? Right, I was sent this one, one of a good friend of mine, and that is the mini survival tin. And this is from Polymar Pod. And straight away, I'm going to say this, and I'm going to be bluntly honest when I say this. Don't waste your money. There's another survival kit kit coming, exactly the same price as this. Looked a lot better. And to me, personally, this is a load of garbage, personally. And um, I don't, I like Polymark products. I like their fire kits. I use their fire stuff all the time. Yeah, but I took that off my um my knife today. As you can see, it's the same size. T it's the same tin, basically. And I'm just gonna open mine up for the minute. And as you can see, mine's chock a block. Mine's full, and I can't fit any more heads if I tried. But this, I don't know. I just I just think it's a waste of money. Personally, that's my opinion. Other people might disagree with me, and then some people might agree with me, but it is to me is the number one of those products. Not worth it. Do not buy, in my opinion. So there's the thing. And in here, this is the contents list now. Oil bag, tin, instruction sheet, fishing tin. Contains 50, 12, 5 to 12, between, uh, contains items, 5 to 12 items. Um, 8 meters of fishing line. That's not a lot. Glow stick. One lure, maggot lure. Two fishing hooks, size 10. Brass eyelet. Split shot, times 2. Hash tag 4. No idea what that means. Times two BB. Two safety pins. Two swivels. Oh, it's ten. One meter of power cord. Fire starter slash whistle unit. Fluid filled compost. Candle. Compressed towel. Micro LED flashlight. Water carrier. Twenty centimeters of fabric. Surgical tape. Alcohol swab, eight water purification tablet, sewing needle and thread, um, signal mirror with basically sticky film, it sticks basically. That is all what's in there. So they class that as one of the items. So, the reason why I say I don't buy this, personally, straight away, it's, I, I don't know. I have gone through this already, so yeah. There it is. With all the contents in. Here's the uh, mini information sheet. Yeah, it does look quite good. It, it does look good. Information sheet. I'm not. I'm not saying they're not. I'm not saying they're not a bad thing. But there is so much more nowadays than this. Personally, they said there's 24 items. And they class that as one of them. So, yeah, let's carry on because it's not bloody only five minutes <laughs> already. Wow. Right. There's the first day stuff and the purification tablets. All in that little baggy. One of those cheap travel stuff you get in a hotel, housewife type stuff, so in kit. There's the LED push button torch, as you can see there. It's a good little thing, but yeah. 
there's the compass and it actually does point north and it is as it said it does it is a liquid base one and it does point north so that's a one good thing in one way the one meter of power cord i'm sorry i don't i honest truthfully don't get that personally you're gonna put power cord on it you could have put power cord around on the outside and put something else inside i just and that's not expensive power cord neither that's quite cheap stuff an oversized candle and i think it is an oversized candle for the wall it is it is a power thin candle there's the any fishing kit as you can see this fishing kit is a good little fishing kit the only thing I as i said i just i don't know I just don't think this is worth the money, personally. What you get, what you're paying for this is what you get. Like, that. like, there's the compressor power. God knows why you put one of them in. There's their water carrier. Basically, a condom, basically. <laughs> and I don't care what anybody says, it is a condom. It's a. Like, like it's more up to date modern technology nowadays to carry water and one of my old friends or mentors who passed away recently his words were when he said when he when he was in the armed forces and when he was in the army he said the only reason they carry condoms it's because just in case they want to fuck, fucking fuck somebody. They didn't carry it because they carried water in it. <laughs> I don't know if anybody's carried water in these things. <laughs> They're just a waste of time. There is the whistle forward convoy. You've seen me have one. I've already got one of these already. There's the forward over there. There's the whistle part. There's the striker over there. there, there. I do like this, this thing, but it's what well, I don't understand. It's their product. Why don't they put one of their own magnesium fairwoods, like fairwoods in here? Magnesium sacks, fairwoods, like um, when you're near. That's the bit. That's the thing I just don't get. But anyhow, and there's the mirror. As you can see, there's the laptop. Yeah, it's just I, 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 I don't know. I'm gonna be adding this to this. Some bits I like from this kit, like this, for example. I'm gonna add that on that. That I don't know. That I do like. That I've got like five or six of them all over the place in my kit. That. No freaking chance, I'm not going to in my kit at all. That, personally, again, waste of time. That, for an oversized candle for this size tin, is ridiculously too big, in my opinion, ridiculous. You could have added other things to this instead of having that. Um, yes, I do like the idea of this one. Don't get me wrong, but what I don't understand. They have their atom lights, what I have in here, what I thought would be another product what they made. It's like they put this tin together without putting products they make. That makes any sense? Yes, it does say polymath. It does say polymath products on the light, but still compressed towel. Yeah, good. But to me, one time use item type thing. Instruction manuals. All survival tips. Um, personally, that's what I think. 
it's just, oh, I, I don't know, it's just to me, it, it just doesn't make sense. For a company who really does comes up with some real good, lovely pieces of equipment to come with this. This was 14 quid apparently, so I'd have to say to people, don't buy, save your money. I've got, an, I've got a panic, there's another survival tin she sent me, a panic cost cheaper than this, but a panic looks a lot better, so we're waiting for that one to come. I just don't, I don't, I don't get it, I don't understand why probably my products bought this crap out personally, but never mind. Right, so I'm going to leave it here guys. Thank you very much for watching. I'm hoping that if you are all still with us watching this video, can still come to 11 minutes. I highly appreciate it. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, save your money. Don't buy that kit. I don't know how they can call it a survival kit. Or a mini survival kit. Tin. I really don't. Personally. Like, this piece of garbage here. How would, would you know when you've got a little wool in there? You're not. Because there's nothing on it. It is just a sodding condom. That's all it is. But never mind. Right. Thank you very much for watching. And we'll see you in the next one. Thank you. Bye bye.